I want to say congrats on the first episode. I just watched it and uh, um, I think it's really good. I think kids are really going to, it's aimed at kids and I think kids are going to love it. Do you lot, do you watch a lot of animated stuff? I watch, uh, well, I, uh, I've watched a fair amount of animated stuff for work and, um, but I, I think it does, you know, not to, uh, it does what it needs to do. And I, I'm a, I'm a fan of having kids getting introduced to Star Trek at an early, I mean, it's never been done before. I think it's a very smart idea. So what do you mean it does what it needs to do? Are you? Uh, because it, it's introducing uh, an, a, a younger audience to Star Trek. Yes, exactly right. And, and you think that it's successful in that regard, these first- 100%. Months. Wonderful. I'm happy to hear you say that. Uh, so something that I think is kind of funny or amusing at least is you make a Voyager and you're dealing with a hologram and now you are the hologram. <laughs> That's right. Bob Picard is having a good laugh. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> I, just, I, found that, I found that amusing. Um, so wh- what has been your favorite part, actually, of making the show in the episodes um, and the scripts you've been reading? I think the, uh, the rather singular experience of being in a recording booth all by myself. Uh, they're on Zoom. And I've got my headset. I've always loved it. I don't know why. It's visceral to me. Um, I love uh, that dynamic. It just between myself, my voice and the page. Um, It's very, very liberating for some reason. Uh, It has to be, I think, if you're going to be an effective voice actor. So I, I very much enjoy the experience. How has it been actually, because obviously you've played this character for many years, you know this character inside and out. How has it been working in terms of you're reading a script and you think to yourself, maybe we want to do it a different way? Or how has it been that sort of, you know, dynamic back and forth with the directors and writers? It's been great. And I get to do it all different kinds of ways. And I do. Um, That is the one great plus uh, voice acting has over live action, because even though you can do a second take and sometimes a third or fourth and a fifth in live action, it's an elaborate to do. I mean, the camera's got to reset and you got to get the angle, you got the lights. But in this case, I can go quickly right away again. I can, I can immediately grasp what it is I wanted to do and do it. And so it's great. Uh, I definitely have to ask you, you were the first female captain in Star Trek which I think is awesome. Uh, What does it actually mean to you uh, being the first female uh, Star Trek captain? You know, it means, it means that I have to be responsible for playing someone who is truly uh, significant uh, in a a deeply resonant way. Um, That's, there's an accountability here. And I've understood that about Janeway. And I hope that I have stepped up to the plate successfully in that regard, because it matters to me. It it also matters to a lot of women out there and a lot of a lot of people. Um, Was there any was there any hesitation on revisiting Janeway in the role? Or was it like, did you have to be convinced or when you heard the idea, were you like, oh, I want to do this? There was hesitation in so far as, as I just said to you, she is so important to me. And that chapter was so vivid and so hard and so worthwhile and so singular uh, to call it back again, I thought might be too uh, taxing, but the opposite has happened. It's been quite freeing. It's been elevating. It's been perfectly enjoyable and i'm i'm having really the time of my life doing it uh when you think back on the making of voyager uh i'm sure you don't miss the long hours and all that but are there what what are the things you you miss about playing the role on almost a daily basis if anything i miss the exercise of that particular kind of discipline which is a very uh reinforcing discipline for an actor to experience. Most actors don't get the shot. Seven years, 16, 18 hours a day, raising two small children by herself. uh, I learned what I'm capable of doing. And I was very pleased to be able to deepen that and uh, to heighten that as the case may be. On that note, I got to stop. I'm just going to say congrats on the series. I hope it's a big hit for you guys. Uh, Thank you for giving me your time. Thank you. Take care. Thanks. Thanks.